All right, we're here for round six of the challenge. Um, I got a mulligan in my hand. Like if I had, if I, if one of these was a cantrip, I would keep my opponent mulligan too. So I'm gonna keep this hand. I think red white's the best. This is probably okay. We'll find a second land. We just want more interaction. Okay. Whoa. This is like the weird. It's like a weird depth deck. Because I would have thought it was like a chalice deck, but the chalice, the blue chalice version of this, I only played Brainstorm. I think so. I think Light Up the Stage is the reason to play the deck. So I'm actually going to ponder here to find a force. Because if they go Dark Depths, Vampire, Hex Mage, I'm dead. That's a second land. I think I have to... We need a second land. So here's what's up. I'm not going to be... I get a random draw out of Force of Will. And I'm not going to beat this game if I don't find another land. I don't, I don't know. So I'm going to draw the land. And we're going to cross our fingers. I'm going to go Dark Death. There's that screen stage, okay. I probably I should have stacked that differently. What am I doing now? I think I'm just holding. No, I'm gonna brainstorm because I can find Force of Will and play Delver. I'm going to hold my spell here. So I'm going to fetch in my upkeep, though. I kind of just, like, they're brainstorm locked. I kind of just want to snap this off and then daze it. I think I'm going to. I think this is, like, wildly aggressive. But I just don't want... Like, I think they're fishing. And they, they, they have a lot of draws just winning the game. And they're brainstorm locked. So they're, they're drawing a dead card, I think. It's not good. Crop rotation for wasteland. Play the land, make it twenty twenty. Yeah, they had it anyways. And we're dead to that. Yep. Yep. 
Okay, so we've ordered an edict, bitter blossom, and click, cut nemesis, cut an angler. I like bringing in a braid because sometimes I turn it like a pithing needle deck. Cut lava man. I'm I'm not playing. I'm probably not playing in any more tournaments for a little while because Phil has some potential health problems. We got to figure out what those are. All right, sounds good. I guess Bitter Blossom is going to protect us. Going to check the twenty twenty for the rest of the game. You aren't the only one. This hand's very good, though. Like, we have two answers to Merit Liege. And we have a grind card, and we have a force plus blue card. Yeah, I mean, we don't know what it is. And it might be nothing. What is this? Jesus. Well, I'm forcing this. And I think I'm getting rid of this ponder. No, I'm you know, I'm not stupid. Okay. I thought I was stupid. I, was like, I could have just spell pierced it, but I'm I'm casting bitter blossom this turn. Now we just hope they don't have a trophy. Don't abrupt, Kami, bro. This is a decay, not just a duress. Okay. <clears throat> My opponent doesn't kill this. I'm in good shape, I think. I can want two of these in my in my board. All right. Got rid of both my ways to deal with Merit Lage. I could hit no, I can't I can't get Gurmag Angler, so I could hit Thought Seize though. Yeah, I mean we're gonna flip this, we're gonna get this Delver in play. Flip it to Bolt, and we're gonna have quite the clock. Dark Depths, okay. Snap, all right. So they're going to be able to assemble the 2020. There's not much I can do about it. The good thing is we're going to be ahead of the 2020. So like in the damage race, we're going to win it. We're probably going to have to eventually hold back Delver and this Fairy Rogue because we don't want to get clowned by a Sejuri step.
Yeah, there's Thespian Stage. So we're just attacking with these two. <clears throat> You can have that. Well, they actually can't make it right now, so we just kill them. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Um, I wonder if Pyroblast is worth it if they have Brainstorms and Stifle. We're 2-2. Two, two. We're trying to be 3-2. No, we're 3-2. We're trying to be 4-2. I don't think I can... Yeah, I don't think I can... I'm going to keep this. Okay, so that's going to name Wasteland. We can daze. They go Dark Depths into Hex Mage. We can daze Hex Mage. I kind of want to daze this because I don't want them to cut off a fetch land because I want to be able to cast this eventually. So I'm going to daze this. Looks odd, but I don't want them. I don't want to hit a. I don't want to get wrecked with them hitting a fetch land. I think they wanted that daze, unfortunately. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. Okay. So they have depths, but they're not playing it. Well, they can't, but. Okay. I'm just going to attack. I'm going to play this Pyromancer and get in there. Like, we've got Merit Lage covered. If my opponent plays like a Liliana the Last Hope, I'm in a lot of trouble. But. Right, there's Hex Mage.
not going to flinch. This is a free shuffle. We'll take this. <clears throat> That's really good. Okay, we're going to fetch in our upkeep. He knows about Edict, yes. The end of my opponent's turn, I'm going to braid this pithing needle. All right, with that on the stack. I'm not going to act because if they have two discard spells, they just make the 20. We waste, they make the 20 20, they go discard spell this, discard spell that, and we're in trouble. So, again, we can't be the first to flinch. Scoop it up. Booyah. 